Ladies and gentlemen, welcome here to the Houston Cardinals Live. I'm here with the running back and the wide receiver, their cousins, family related, D. Scott and the Lynch Mob. What's up, Q? Not much, man. Talk about the game tonight, man, real quick. You ran really? hard out there tonight. Can't say too much about it, man. We, we wasn't on key. Everybody was off. Playing with a different team every week could do that to you. And we got to come to practice, man. We, we're not gelling together at all. D. Scott, talk about it real quick. What's going on here in the 2010 season? Really, I think it's more or less about dedication between, you know, the entire team, offense and defense-wise. We can't get dedication from both parts. Then, you know, it's not going to gel together. You guys out there are playing your hardest. Quincy, again, going almost over 100 yards tonight. Tell me, what keeps your fire burning, and are you trying to get to the next level? Trying to get to the next level. That's why I play so hard, man. And I just want it. I love it. I... How do you keep yourself prepared? Because you might get that call from, like, a Houston Texans or a Dallas Cowboys to come and try out for a practice squad. I mean, how would that make I you feel? I want the Cowboys. You want the Cowboys? Want the Cowboys you want... We both want they the just Cowboys picked up Dez Bryant, but I'll, you know, I'll play special teams for now. Until and, I... and tell me, now, now, right now, you're playing for free. You're not playing no money. If you get a call and get a chance to play, how would that feel? Great, I'm normal. First train out of there. I'm gone. <laughs> Zero in, I'm out of there. <laughs> how does how do you keep your conditioning and everything up through the summer to be prepared for that call? We run on Wednesday. Run on Wednesday. We get the it's a special day that y'all run on Wednesday. What's so special about Wednesday? <laughs> yeah, that's our practice. day off from practice. So oh, we okay. We do our own little thing. We hit the hill, run, do a whole bunch of stuff. Illinois Tinsley Park, 45 and Allen Parkway. Y'all want to join us? Welcome to come out. Come out there and get welcome for it, huh? Yeah. So right now you're playing free of charge. You're playing because you guys love the game, correct? Yeah, so absolutely. Quincy, if you get that call to get actually paid to do what you love, tell me how would that feel? Oh, uh, man, I'm dropping it. Everything. <laughs> I'm gone. <laughs> Calling a job and everything right there. <laughs> so tell me, how do you keep yourself up in the off season? Uh, just working out. Uh, I hit the gym a lot, probably like four or five times a week. And uh, like we said, we run on our uh, our free day, so okay. That's bit, that's you say four or five times a week. Yeah, man, I ain't been to the gym four or five times in a couple of years. <laughs> D. Scott, talk to me now, real quick. If you was to look and tell a high school player how to keep his attitude in check to get on the next level, what would you tell him? Listen to your coaches. I mean, you still gotta. You can't be a quiet guy. You gotta have some type of swag on the field. Okay. I mean, don't don't just sit there and don't say anything. Oh, I don't talk. I ball. You right. Know? No, none of that. You gotta still listen to your coaches. Be a coachable player okay as long as you're coachable you can always make adjustments from you know here and there okay talk about it Quincy talk about the attitudes of a player getting to the next level you got to be real disciplined and you got to be coachable you got to be able to listen to the coach and do what he tell you to do no questions asked when you talk back you're starting to question your authority figure so when you listen and you're coachable it's going to get you to that next level because you're going to listen listen and get better and get better I think you guys have the talent to get to the next level and I think one day I'm pretty sure pretty soon that you guys will get that call to get your shot guys thanks for coming to the show right, good luck we, in the season it's not over we're going to Disneyland we're going to Disneyland <laughs> baby